This is gate 2014 set 3 EC question number 31. In the circuit shown in the figure, the value of node voltage V2 in volts is being asked. Four options are given. For NPTEL reference, you can watch lecture number 6, Nodal Analysis Part 1, Network Analysis by Professor Tapush Kumar Bhattacharjo, Department of Electrical Engineering, IIT Kharagpur. The YouTube reference lecture link is given here. The useful data that will be needed in order to solve this question is that whenever there is a voltage source connected at the two nodes without internal impedance, the two nodes together form a super node. The KCL cannot be applied directly for individual nodes if voltage source is connected between them because then we cannot calculate the current flowing in that voltage source because there is no internal impedance of that voltage source. So the KCL can be applied together at the super nodes that is to considering the both the nodes comprising of that voltage source excluding the branches connected in between the two nodes what i meant to say is that for coming to the solution and explaining the concept of super node that if v1 and v2 are two nodes and a voltage source is connected to between them directly applying kcl at this node let us name it a and b is not individually possible because the current flowing through this cannot be calculated as this has no internal impedance so these two nodes together form a super node and kcl can be directly applied at that super node the kcl at super node comprising of node a and b can be written by excluding the branches connected between a and b so excluding branches connected between a and b to be written down as the current flowing into the node a the current going out the current going out here and the current going out here so now the current going in to node a b that is the super node the super node some current is going in which is 4 which equals the current going out now this branch is excluded and this branch is excluded because it is part of the super node it is connected between the super nodes this branch this branch this branch and this branch are considered so the current flowing in is 4 current going out is v1 divided by minus j3 plus v2 divided by 6 plus v2 divided by j6 minus v2 equal to 10 so v1 can be written down as from this equation and putting the value of this equation in this equation v1 can be written as 10 plus v2 divided by minus j3 plus v2 by 6 plus v2 by j6 it's j24 equal to this is minus 2 so minus 20 minus 2 v2 plus v2 which implies that 20 plus j24 minus v2 plus jv2 so v2 equal to 20 plus j24 divided by j minus 1 into j plus 1 on both sides this is coming j square minus 1 j square is itself minus 1 so writing minus 2 20 j j squared is minus 1 so minus 24 plus 20 plus j 24 so v2 value comes out to be 10 j minus 12 plus 10 plus j 12 with a minus sign j 22 and this one is 2 so this comes like this 2 minus j22 so v2 value is 2 minus j22 so option d is the correct option thank you